hello guys as we were dis uh, as in the previous video i did uh, i told you about my interview experience in iit for vlsi companies for intel and qualcomm uh, in this video i will be sharing my interview experience with ti analog and ti digital and uh, in the next video i will share the that will be the last video i will share the interview experience of tsmc so uh, both interview ti analog and uh, digital happen like separately not uh, in a single interview so in interview they first ask me about uh, my strong part like which uh, i am comfortable with open or uh, mosfet uh, so i told them i am okay with uh, open so they give me few circuit based questions so i will show you that uh, question here the first question was open based uh, yes, all resistance are r here and uh, voltage here is one volt so so they he the interviewer asked me the node voltage at each node and uh, all branch current what will be the current value in each uh, branch uh, that was the first question then the second question was uh, they give a rc circuit parallel rc uh, that rc circuit they give simple rc circuit Uh, they gave this RC circuit uh, to check uh, my capacitance and that uh, how I am dealing with the initial and final value. So they asked me here that voltage uh, V not initial and final value. The third one was a positive feedback RC circuit. It is a positive circuit. First, they made uh, a positive feedback op amp and asked me about voltage at the output. This was R, this is R, so this is VO, here V in, they asked me about the output voltage, then he asked uh, me to replace this R by C, and then uh, they asked me about the output voltage, like steady state output voltage actually, when steady state value of the V naught, also at this point, uh, and to confuse me uh, in the last they replace this r and c here this r and c so they make c here r here and they ask me uh, what will be the node voltage so this was about the analog part coming to digital interview in digital interview first question like they were more focused on memory part and uh, so they asked me about what is cache memory different type of cache memory they are just keep asking in continuation whatever different types of cache memory I said like on chip off chip and whatever the cache memory then they said like what do you mean by on chip and off chip uh, why we required like on chip cache or why we required off chip cache why we cannot have both the cache memory at uh, on on chip this type of question then they gave me a memory of width 32 bit and 4 kb size and asked me to make a memory of width 128 bit and 32 kb size they asked me how i will make uh, next question they asked me on setup and hold time they asked me uh, to show through waveforms how i will show them like uh, setup and hold violations and then for uh, continuation they asked me like what will be the issue with the asynchronous clock and the thing then there was two questions based on the waveforms. So what they asked, they gave me uh, three waveforms. Uh, basically not three waveforms, so it's just a clock. So it's, uh, this was a clock and uh, then there is an input A, which is something 
like this something like this and the question was the first question was uh, they asked me first uh, they want me to make a circuit using d flip flops which is a positive edge uh, flip flop means uh, the clock is as positive edge and they ask me to draw a circuit in which output y the output y will be whenever this negative edge of a will come whenever this negative edge will come the y should hold that value for two clock cycle uh, for two clock cycle and for the rest of part uh, the circuit will behave should behave as a normal or uh, deep flip flop this was the first question they uh, just ask me to draw a circuit using d flip flop i can uh, we can use they asked me they said like you can use any number of d flip flop the flop will be positive edge clock uh, positive edge clock flop and then that at the negative edge of a y should hold that value for two clock cycle like previous value for two clock cycle that was a question first and the second question they asked whenever this negative edge will come y should toggle uh this was uh, for me the longest interview uh, it took the la because they ask me keep asking me the question going deep in the cache memory and setup and hold violation then uh, they loop me trick me in this uh, deep flip flop question uh thank you this is all about my ti analog and digital interview